Okay, this is an idea to build a uh, one-person four-wheel bicycle uh, recumbent from two cheap mountain bikes that you can buy at, uh, at Walmart. This is the mountain bike. The idea is to take off the the uh, well to cut it right across here take off the crank and cut this back frame and put extenders in it like this it still will operate the shock absorber uh, the seat's gone the handlebars are off and the sprockets are off because it'll be driven from a shaft that goes across both wheels. Taking out the uh, the crank. Now you join two of these bicycles with some uh, crossbars connected at these points these four points and then there will be a, a tube between the uh, the dropouts on the left and right bicycle with the shaft going through it to drive both wheels. We'll mount a, uh, a little recumbent seat back here coming off of these crossbars to hold it up cantilevered off the crossbars. And the drive system will be a linear drive rather than a rotating crank. You just push, pull, not pull, but push with this one, push with the other leg. Uh, this is the rider sitting inside of the left one and I'm going to put the right bike on top of him so he's sitting between the bikes uh, the steering on the front is done indirectly in other words he'll, he'll pull handlebars back here and then levers will extend up to the to the stems and turn the front wheels and they'll be connected with uh, Atkinson linkage so that they will turn at the proper angles for each circle. This is a this on the bottom is the URL to uh, a YouTube video showing the linear drive. Now their linear drive works up and down mine would work at a diagonal the way the legs are probably do this for under five hundred dollars maybe I'll lose some weight you'll see a skinnier rider on there what else Well, the linear drive system will be in the middle and it'll operate uh, a couple of free wheels, one on each leg. And the free wheels will turn a common shaft. That will uh, run a chain back here to the derailleurs in the middle and that'll be on the shaft between the two rear wheels.